Okay. So Melissa's going to do her um, kind of banshee. She has that throughout where she can walk and bump, bump, and just keep on moving. Um, Nina, pretend you're holding a giant beach ball. And when you, instead of just like walking, your walk will be like that beach ball is a giant eye and you see only with that eye. And it's like you're a um, big caterpillar with this big eye in front of you. Yeah, and so when you sit down, you sit down kind of holding this eye. <laughs> Graceful, okay. <laughs> um, Emma, you're gonna do the Medusa. So as you walk, you have every once, when you switch directions, is it that way? That way. So you cross the opposite leg, uh, the leg of which you want to turn. So if you want to turn to your right, you cross the right leg and your arm comes up and shoots a glare. And then you walk. Yeah. So you have this like, and then you walk, continue walking. Um, you can also make that fancy as a way to sit down too. If you're like, Whew. it's just like, ooh, fancy. Seems fancy. Okay. Um, we had the gray. We had the bat things, which was Melissa. So I'm like, might as well she just keep it. Um, Noah was a harpy, so Noah, on the recording, your walk is still going to be just really low and like just really low, like it was before. Um, Medusa, why well, can't I remember the other characters? <laughs> there were so many characters. Oh. Amanda's group. And Miss Tracy, that should be Miss Tracy. Um, Miss Tracy, when you start in a direction, you're going to do um, a one arm flap dragging that direction first. So you're going to go drag and then continue down. And if you want to change directions, you would drag that way, drag and then change, drag, change, 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 drag, you're like drag, drag. <laughs> that, that movement doesn't give you a lot. Like all of a sudden you're across your room. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Janessa. Oh, Janessa can be the traveler. Um, so Janessa, there's, you're always looking over your shoulder, um, like sideways. So when you're walking, you walk sideways, very paranoid. Does that make sense? Yeah. So for some of you, the walking is a little awkward because you're actually walking kind of sideways or you're walk, you're looking one direction, but walking straight in another. All right, so that's the first section, and that is your walk. So when you walk, you don't actually just like walk. Some of you have like, Emma's kind of walks, and then she's like, yeah. All right, so that's the first section. Second one is um, stop time. This, you do have to pay attention to the screen. So stop time, if anyone stops, you also stop. Got that? Awesome. 
uh, sitting down and laying down doesn't count as stop time, it's walking. So if you stop walking. So if, like, if Emma sits, she's of course stopped, but that doesn't count as a stop time. So step one is just standard, you're just create, creating your space. Step two is stop time. Step three is pose, I think. Yeah, pose. <laughs> the role I would want is Noah's part. Because <laughs> I just picture like a baby naked vulture that's just like. <laughs> It's a drastic change in music. You'd be like, oh, this is it. It's like, hum na, hum na, hum na, hum na. This is the stop time music. Yeah, drastic change. You're like, okay. Next one is poses. Here's the next one. Yeah, you hear it's a drastic change. Everybody's good with these big sound cues. Okay, so Nina, your pose is here. It's to signify cult coming up. Um, Tracy, you're going to be here to signify um, the theme of slavery throughout because you have that big solo later. Um, I think Sammy Solo is also in Cult. We can't do Suleiman, it just happened. It's for the future. Um, Melissa is, oh, here. So Melissa, when you watch the video, you're here. Um, Noah, you're there, so make sure you're in a Luigi 4 <clears throat> for a hotel. Um, Janessa should be something Roanoke. But you can't be like, uh-uh, because there's no pig head in your hand or knife. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, um, uh, I think it's here. Yeah. So you have a, like a platter in your hand, your hands on your back, and you're there. That's in the Roanoke duet. Okay, back to Emma. 
All I see is Sammy like this. <laughs> That's not all she does. There's like jumps. Okay, let's move on to another theme she has. Oh! Take it into, yeah. Like you're being crucified and burned at the stake. Okay, so not too far back. Yeah, next to you and then there. All right, so that's everybody's pose. Um, after pose, so now you're stopped. You, we don't do stop time unless you're like literally standing still. So if you're, if for Nina, she's here and she's like, dun, dun, dun. If she stops here, then you have to add that on and pay attention and stop also. If she does her pose, that's not a stop time. It's just something added. And I want you to add your poses and sit, stand, move, pose, sit, stand, move, pose, sit, stand, move, pose, stop. So it starts to look like choreography. The problem with this is a, a lot of people just like they don't keep moving. So it looks like dancing. Yeah. Um, sit, stand, lay down, <gasps> pose. All right. So that's the next one is you add your pose and you try to catch the stop times. You try. The next one is variation on your pose. You can change its plane. You can break an angle of it. So Nina's, she's here. She can then take it here. Like that's a break on the break on the pose. There, she can do it there in a plie, there. You can do it laying down. <laughs> yeah, they're all variations of the same pose. Okay, everybody's good with the steps so far? And then we have movement. Okay, so first one. It's just walking. You're just walking pattern. The grid. Second one, stop time. Third one, pose. Fourth one, variations of your pose. Questions? Okay, so your pose music has this kind of like, ah, sound. <laughs> This is our stop time music. Ah, pose music. So now we're in a waltz. Yeah, so the waltz is your pose music. Now it's a little latin -y. This is our transition to variations on a pose. Seven, eight, one, two. So now you can do your pose, you can sit, you can stand, you can, you have all these options. Variations on your pose, all through this like weird chanting music. And then I'm going to teach you three eighths of choreography Ooh. that you all stop whatever the hell you're doing, dance together, and then continue doing your nonsense. Okay, do you want to try that so far and then we'll learn those three eighths of choreography? 
that the three eights of choreography that you're all going to do becomes another motif. So then you can add any, after you all dance it together, you can add any, any element of that choreography to anything that you're doing. Yeah, so if you're like, I like this step. So Nina's like, hmm. <laughs> You can just keep adding those elements together. And then of course, you're also trying to pay attention to the screen to see if someone does a stop time. Mm. <laughs> so he's like, I'm not gonna do that. What if we all agree <laughs> not to do stop time? <laughs> There's a private group text of, do not do stop time after the going out. Do not do that. <laughs> Ellie is not gonna give us a note about, oh, look, Noah did stop time. It's like, Noah. Like the Marco Polo group without you. Yeah. <laughs> just to discuss the chase. Are we all in agreement? Mm -hmm. We can all just do our own thing. Okay. So let's try that and then we'll learn our choreography. The mm, 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 mm. And I'll cue you. I'll be like, this is the next part. Okay. Good luck, everybody. Thanks. You're welcome. That's three and a half minutes of choreography that you're doing. And go when you're ready. Oh my god, it's already brilliant. <laughs> it's already so good. <laughs> Feel free to also change your tempo and how fast you move. And add stop time. And poses. Good. Feel that beat so that you're good, beautiful. Yeah, so it's just a little bit faster movement. Variations of your pose. And seven, eight. Oh, cool, Janessa. Cool, Emma. Cool, Tracy. Yeah, Nina, I like that hinge. Ooh, I like that it fell. Oh, cool, Tracy. Oh, I like that, Emma. That looks so good. Oh, 
Okay, we're already at the choreography. How'd that feel, guys? Okay, <laughs> small and constricting. <laughs> So Tracy, if you remember in Illumination, the Matt Bednarski show, we did a grid on the small stage with the entire modern group and they had no space. I forgot about that. And the advanced ones had all this choreography that they had to do also. That was just, oh my gosh. Yeah. Where they're like, and jump in the air, don't hit anyone. As long as you walk in a straight line, we won't hit you. We keep walking. <laughs> yeah. When, when dancers like, I don't have enough space. Not, yeah, we gotta do this, where someone's like, you have to jump in the air, and as long as they're doing a grid, they're not gonna get hit, right? You can aim, a straight line, okay. All right, so this choreography goes, I literally don't know the counts. It goes with the words, it goes, ba, 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 da, 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 da. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> so, so, let me play it. <laughs> you guys are so great. You're like, all right. <laughs> let me play it because it'll make sense when he sings it. <laughs> So you have, nice and big, like, ah. Uh. So uh, let's actually not stick out our butt. Let's not arch our back. So one to diamond two, and then back in, out. And then you have arch with a flap, bring it back. So it goes, ma, 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 flap in. Yeah, so one diamond in, diamond flap in. And really re go ahead and release your neck completely so the back of your head hits your shoulders on that. Uh, a la like when we get to coven, all that like <laughs> releasing that happens. Yeah. Um, huh, huh, huh. <laughs> your arms open, your left arm is, um, is like a little swan, your right arm swings all the way up, it scoops and switches. So from here they open, let this continue, and then bring it towards you to scoop to switch it so it faces back. So it goes open, swing, scoop, back. Does that make sense? Good. From here, you throw that left arm and it's like a whip. So you're gonna lead from the shoulder and then you're gonna bring it back through the shoulder. You do that two times. The third time, it's gonna go over your head and bring you to the other side and you flap your hands on five, six, seven, eight, which, and your head also lifts. Lift, 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 lift. That's the choreography. <laughs> That's all, got it. <laughs> no, 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 I'm kidding, Miss Tracy. <laughs> so from open, <laughs> she's like, thank you, I'm leaving. <laughs> So we open, this is very cult, the um, coven style choreography with all the like throwing around um, to like prep for everybody, wait till the finale, wait till coven with all the like, all of that stuff that you guys get to do at the end. Okay, so from the open, open, swing, scoop, whip, bring it back, whip, bring it back, whip, bring it back over your head, 
five, six, seven, eight. Yes. Yeah, literally just like be a noodle. Just whew, the more you can really release your body through it. Now, so that you don't tear anything, it's very important that you guys all really warm up. Yeah, because the more physical you get with it, the better it'll look, but also the more likely you could tear something. So you just want to make sure you're nice and limber and warm, even though this piece doesn't necessarily have a lot of like, oh, I don't have to kick, I don't have to, but that you're going to, yeah, you, just not hurt ourselves. Okay, so the beginning. You have contract, diamond, contract, diamond, up, down, open, swing the hand to the back, a A, A A, A A over your head, five, six, seven, eight. Kind of? I promise it'll make more sense with music. Can I do it with music? Can we do it with music? Okay. So if you're listening to the chase, it's at like 320. And then it's two eights before you start. So you hear that beat, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, bum, 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 bum. Uh, your a a masino, masino, five, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, there's a breath there. Uh, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Open, scoop the hand. A A Machino. Machino, ma, hold it, and five, six, seven, eight. Yeah? Kind of? Let's do that again. Five, six, seven, and two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, ha, 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 flat, back, open, scoop it back, hey, hey, must be no, must be no, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Um, the, the, we bring this arm down, is it here or here? Oh, do I have it up? I do, I have it up. Yay, my body wants to do up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this one turns and it stays up, yeah. Janessa? Can I go real quickly, like, like three seconds to go to the bathroom real quick? Can, can you what? Can you what? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I spoke really fast. Can I go to the bathroom really fast? Yeah. No. If you want something, you have to be understood, though. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the rest of us, let's just do that again, yeah? Okay, so then that is your choreography. After you all dance that, you then go back and you can use elements of that choreography. You can use elements of that choreography in halftime. You don't have to keep it in that tempo. Yeah, so if, you know, Noah's like, ding, 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 mm, 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 right? He can just like, Add, yeah, or huh. yeah, you can all just like start tweaking and moving and then hopefully speed it up. So, the first time through, you guys did such a great job. I just want to be sure that you guys 
also find elements of tempo changes because we're all walking really slowly. So you can like move quick, move quick and slow. Yeah, and you can do your transition quick. If you have, if, for those of you who have transitions, like Tracy and Emma have transitions to rotate. So you can do them and then keep going. Mm -hmm. You can play with tempo. All right, let's try that choreography again. At 320-ish. <laughs> Two, five, six, seven, eight, one. Open, scoop it back, A, A. Masino, Masino, Masino. Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, do you hear that like, so you can literally, actually let's just call that slow-mo. The next section will slow-mo. So everything you do is slow motion. So unless you can go to the floor in slow motion, don't sit. <laughs> Without looking like you have to poo. <laughs> I have no Achilles, like I yeah. would just like go for That's it. That's why I'm tucking my foot, because you just sit, but we all have Achilles. <laughs> so we're not going to do that, especially if I can't use my hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you could now, right? We still have Achilles. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all of us. <laughs> Miss Tracy's like, they're overrated. You don't need them. <laughs> okay, so you slow-mo, and then after the slow-mo music, you'll go back to regular tempo playing. So you have all those elements, including stop time. You have all those elements. <laughs> we did one stop time during stop time, guys. There was one. It's a lot easier in person because you can feel the like movements stop behind you. Like you're like, there's no, there's no wind. There's no nothing moving. So you can feel there's nothing moving. Stop. Oh, they were just sitting still. Okay. They were just mm -hmm. sitting. It's fine. Um, and then the last part is called monkey mind where everybody does the same thing. So we're in, right now we're in that slow-mo music. Ooh, that was cool on the Still in slow-mo, there's no beat. Back to regular tempo. You can even do that choreography again because it's the same music. Hey, hey. Here's the last part. So after you hear that music, that same music that we have for the choreography, you have that same thing again. It goes, that's a cue for monkey mind. Monkey mind is someone does something and everybody follows. The only person who has any like hardcore decision making skills is going to be Emma. So it's, yeah. I mean, we might as well just acknowledge. <laughs> that Emma's gonna do something and everyone's yeah. gonna follow. <laughs> Spain. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, we're just gonna call that spade and just say, look at that shovel right there. Yeah, that's. <laughs> I mean, everybody else is just gonna stare at the camera and go, who's gonna do something? Which is doing something that everybody's just staring at. That's doing something, and that is monkey mind. Everybody's just staring. And it's only like it's only like an eight or a two. It's really really short. So you don't want to turn it into like choreography. I would actually recommend like picking a pose or a slow movement or something. And I. Think it would be best if it did move like towards the camera or toward your um whatever emma does mm -hmm. if i move toward your um keyboard mm -hmm. because it transitions into murder house mm -hmm. so that way you can walk over and turn it off turn your screen off Or, you know, sometimes Noah's brave. So I could say no, like Noah could also come up with something. But we Melissa. Might as well just delegate. <laughs> no, that's not the point of the piece. So between Emma and Noah, because Melissa's not going to do something, Janessa, Nina, Tra you guys aren't going to do anything. Maybe Janessa, she's like super brave that day. Oh, those eyebrows. She's like, that's not going to happen. Okay, mm -hmm. just kidding. All right. That's the chase. That's the whole piece. You guys ready to try it? Questions? Do you have questions? Yeah, Miss Tracy. For some reason, it's really difficult to hear on my speakers. So if you could still cue us when the changes come, because I'm not really hearing them. So sure, I'm actually um, the only thing. So I can switch it to share my audio, so you can hear all of the music changes. The only part is I can't do the choreography because I'll be slightly off. But does everybody know that choreography and how that's supposed to fit? Awesome. Oh, am I like eh? Mostly. Mostly. I'll still dance it, but we're going to be slightly, Nina and I will be slightly behind. Yeah. I mean, we'll be on time for us, but if you guys are watching, we're going to be slightly behind. That, ha, 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 my sino, my way, and five, and six, and seven, eight. Okay, I'm gonna share um, because it's the music is so layered, and it was back when I was like, let me discover Garage Band. So it's <laughs> <laughs> it's I think 20 different Cirque du Soleil songs that I have put together into one big track for. Um, Contos. And the reason I like this piece is because Contos was the escape from the underworld. And this was the song to get out. So I'm like, let me use the same song to get in. Mm. Yay. Spicy. In the event that we're like, hey, let's do Contos after, you know, we've done One World. We've done, let's do Contos and let's escape the underworld. We're down, now we're coming back up. Yes. I really liked it. I loved Contos. That's good. Well, the experience was yeah, the show was so awful. <laughs> so awful. The experience was so. Yeah, that was a bad group that year. That was that was the group. That was the shit group. Yep. From hell, the sure fifteen there. dancers from hell. That was the year that I was like, fuck this. I'm not doing visionary anymore. But then we only had six and we did American Horror Story after that. So I was like, all right, you guys sucked, but let's. Can you hear it? Okay. When you're ready. I'm just going to do Noah's track because it's a fun track. 
Alyssa's well, like, why don't you do my drag? You can also move backwards. Hello. <laughs> Add stop time. poses. It's a waltz, so just a little bit faster. Variations on a pose. Choreography. Slow-mo. Double time. Quick monkey mind. Monkey mind, what's Right, so that one didn't quite work. That monkey mind, yeah? Emma did Emma was still doing her own thing. <laughs> uh, 
I was like, shoot, I forgot to look at the camera and then I didn't know what was happening. So after you hear that same let me just play it. <laughs> so that was... Right here. This is Monkey Mind. It's literally only two eights. Yeah, it's only two eights. So something. But everyone look at the screen. And if Emma doesn't do something, everybody's standing still, then. But it's one thing. So if someone's still dancing, like ignore them. They're, yeah, if Emma's still dancing, you're like, ah, she bailed on us. She is not paying attention. Janessa was like, don't do that <laughs> with her eyes. Questions about that? We have time, we're gonna do it again, we're gonna do it again, we're gonna do it again. So you can keep playing and creating and building and be like, this is what I'm gonna do. <clears throat> but it's not like the grid. Now, um, Martha Graham actually took Cunningham's grid and created this whole piece based on that. And when um, Tracy and I went to see the Graham company, they did it. And that's when the girl, like, she jumped with flex feet and did plie. Yeah, she just levitated. It was incredible. <laughs> that little blonde, I was like, how is she doing that? <clears throat> just repel her gravity. Yeah, but it was the grid. I was like, this is a grid. This is the grid. They're doing the grid. Oh, and there's the variation. And yeah. And then they took... Um, other pieces of Martha Graham's choreography and they stuck those in as motifs and they're like, you can do these at any point. So you saw like, yeah, it was cool. It was a cool way to interpret the grid. Ours is cooler, whatever. All right. So <laughs> we're cooler than Graham, not really. Um, but guys, it looks really, really cool. It does, it, especially the beginning. The beginning just really looks like where, er, like where are we going? What's going on? Not like uh, dancers don't know what's happening, but you know what I'm saying? Like it looks, so remember that this is the descent into hell. So we do need to build the anxiety, like the song builds, the music builds an anxiety. We need to build your anxiety as we get further on in the piece from slow-mo even though it's slow-mo it shouldn't be like slow-mo water lyrical it should be slow-mo like trying to push through so that it still has that muscled angst in it does that make sense cool cool i'm gonna stop recording <laughs>